Hallelujah. God is a good God. I said God is a good God. Hallelujah. Some people only can praise Him. Long as things are going good. Long as things are all right. But when bad times come, they get mad with God. They fool with God. But praise is what I do. I say praise Somebody say he's on time, God. Yes, he is. He may not come when you want it. He may not come when I want it. But he's always, he's always, he's always. Okay. Lord took me last night. Couldn't hardly sleep. Ooh. Couldn't hardly sleep. Got up and Got a cap in my deep, couldn't have a walk. Said, devil, you a lie. I'm going to preach this one. I'm going to preach this guy. Hallelujah. My mind went to Psalms 34. Hallelujah. That's what everyone is saying. Psalms 34. Psalms of David. That's if you all understand. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They said if they want to stand, please. That's able. They said now they understand. Praise the Lord. We read it all together, verses 1 through 8. Psalms 34, verse 1 through 8. Uh -huh. Give everyone a chance to get it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Psalms 34 says, I guess the page is still turning. Psalms chapter 34, verses 1 through 8. Everyone had the same mind. Amen. It begins as this all together. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall make her boast. And the Lord, the humble shall hear thereof and be glad. glad. O oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and he heard me, and delivered me from all my fears. They looked unto him, and were lightened, and their faces were not ashamed. This poor man cried, and the Lord heard him. And save him out of all his troubles. The angels of the Lord encamp round about them that fear him and deliver them. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man that trusted in him. We have read Psalms 34, verse 1 to 8. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of his word. Father, in the precious name of Jesus, come before your humbleness we know yes. Thank you for your goodness and mercy. Thank you, Lord. Allow me to be used by you. Lord, I ask you to go before your word. Let it go out and accomplish what you would have it to accomplish. Don't let it come back, boy. And we'll be so careful beyond the praise and glory. We thank you and I see blessing Jesus. Jesus. I like to take time to give out a couple of pastor, Bishop Hubert Phillips, our elder, Elder Elder Sua, all the ministers, thanks to God as a whole. The Lord laid this scripture on my heart. I feel like David. I go through some rough times, hard times. But David said, I will bless the Lord. At all times. That means when I'm going through different obstacles, I'm still going to praise Him. Sometimes I know people probably think I'm crazy when they come past my house. I'd be sick and I'd just be praising the Lord. I have tough trouble comes in my life. i just be over there just praising the Lord all by myself. Because I'm a blessing at all times. Whether He's doing something or whether He doesn't, I'm still going to bless Him. 
I said, I'm still going to bless him. Whether he gave me money or he don't, that's how I'd rather right. still go to bless him. Huh? Whether it's through the good, the song said, and through the bad. Whether I'm happy or whether I'm sad, I'm still going to bless him. I'm still going to praise him. Somebody said, I won't complain. Because he knows what's best for me. I mean, he knows. He knows. You may not know it, but he knows what's best for you. Even though your weary eyes can't see. But somebody said, I won't complain. I can, but I, I'm not going to complain. Because I know he knows what's best for me. He knows my ups. He knows my downs. He knows everything. Everything. God is good. That's why David said, my soul should boast in the Lord. I can boast in that brag on him all day long. Even when things ain't going right, I still can brag on him. I can say, that's still my God. That's still my Jesus. Oh, he's a faithful. He's a keeper. I said, he's a keeper. I heard all the beautiful songs. You know, that's what stirs me up. Yes. Give me my praise and worship yes. songs. Yes. Praise is what I do. Yes. Then David began to tell the people, so magnify the Lord with me. Yes. See, that's all. I don't want you to feel sorry for me. I think mean, Paul said, don't weep for me. Don't weep for me. Because all of this is going to break together for me. Now, you told me, no, you got to go through all this. Oh, no, I'm so, oh, I'm so hurt. No, 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 no. Pray for me. All you got to do is just pray for me. Just pray for me. You know, I praise the Lord. God is so good. I see my daughter in the house. I didn't go around telling everybody. But I sit there, I said, Sister Vanna fell on my heart a couple months ago. Sister Vanna said, yes. Where's my daughter? I said, Carolyn, where is she? And today, Carolyn is in the house! I said, she's here! Thank you. I didn't go around talking about our pray! Thank you. And I kept calling her Sister Val. That's the Sister Val. Carolyn is on my heart! That's why I praise her. It just don't have to be my child. I'm praying for somebody else's child. Amen. I'm praying for somebody else's child. Somebody said, I have no prayer change things. I said, I have no prayer change things. Whenever you pray, don't you try to have your way. Let him have his way. Because I have no prayer change things. Prayer change things. Forget about talking about it. Just pray about it. You want to see God pray things? Let me tell you some other things. Oh, my Lord. Mother Solomon. I keep telling Ricky, pray for Ricky, pray for him. She said, he already prayed for him. We already praying for him. We ain't got to put him to listen no more. He already up the last. Yes. Thank you, Lord. And I got a call. He got in trouble. Say, yeah, all things went together for good. Got in trouble. Thank you, Lord. He was talking to me and told me what and what. That's all right. The Lord knows how to get your attention. Yes. He don't try to get your attention. He gets it. He don't get it. He caught my son. Every time. Every time. He gets your attention. Yes. You know what? I love the Lord. Yes. The Lord is so good. Look at the time that we're living in. You know, the Lord laid down my heart. You know, God is a good God. When we look at the time we're living in, people's are shooting, shooting down all over the place. Yes. Different areas. But my Bible said the angel of the Lord and trap about them that fear them. Yes. See, I'm sleeping at night, but the bullets bypassing me because the angel of the Lord yes. and cabin about me. Hallelujah. He's worthy to be praised. If I had 10,000 tongues, somebody said this thing. I said, if I had 10,000 tongues, I would just praise him. If I couldn't say a word, I'd just wave my hand. I'd just wave my hand. Because God is good. I want you to know, whatever you're going through today, just know, God's got it all in control. How many believe that? Oh, 
has got it all and control. We could have reassured us with the last Come on, next time. Oh, yes, you 
troubled. No matter what you're going through. Amen. And the preacher said, I will bless the Lord at all times. And his praise shall continually be in my mouth. No matter what we're going through this morning. The Lord wants us to know, continue to bless him. Continue to lift him up. Continue to praise him. Somebody said, praise your way through.
name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Let's pray the Lord. All you have to do is just trust the Lord. Whatever the situation, whatever the condition, whatever the problem seems to be, God is more than able. David said, I'm going to bless the Lord at all times. And not only am I going to bless him, but his praise is going to continually be in my mind. That means he's going to speak it every time. He's going to give God the praise every time. For the good times, and the not so good time. Because with God, every time is good. God doesn't have a bad day. And if we believe that God always has good days, then we can look beyond the things that comes in our life and see God. We have to look beyond everything that the enemy places in front of us and see God. Doesn't matter how dim it looks. See God. It may get rough. Let me just change that. It will get rough. Not may, it will get rough. But if you believe in God, and you trust in God, and you depend on God, all you have to do is just Throw your hands up. See, when you surrender to the Lord, you're yielding yourself to Him. He'll fix it for you. Doesn't matter, it would be good if you're saved. But if you're not saved, God still hears you. Don't God doesn't hear in His prayer. He still does. I was a sinner once and I called on Him and He heard me. standing here today, all you have to do is believe. Only believe.
start to praise the Lord through the good times and the better times. Let's not wait. The Bible says this poor man cried and the Lord heard him and delivered him out of some of his sorrow, out of a few of his sorrow. David know what was going on when he ran from King Achish and went to Gath and they after him, Saul was after him and that's why he said, I will bless the Lord at all. Started to spit on himself. They said, this man is mad. But guess what? I will bless the Lord at all times. Hard times are here. But we still can bless the Lord. His praise shall be in my mouth a few times. At all times, continually. Continually. The same way the blood is running through your veins continually. Guess what? His praise is going to be in our mouth continually. Give God the praise. Give God the glory. Give God the honor. When things go the way that you didn't expect, thank the Lord anyway. The Bible says, in everything. It didn't say for everything. It says in everything. Give thanks. Your heart is heavy. Give it to the Lord. David said, when my heart is overwhelmed. You know what it means to be overwhelmed? It means that you just can't control it. You know, you can't manage all these situations. He said, just lead me to the rock that is higher than I. That rock is Jesus. Is there somebody who needs to be saved today? Praise the Lord. Just praise the Lord. Just praise the Lord. When we come to the house of the Lord, we don't just come to sing and hear somebody sing and hear somebody do this. We, we, we hear the testimony, but we come into the house. The Bible says, I'm going to enter into his gate. In my heart. I will enter his court with praise. Enter into his gate with thanksgiving. Let the shout be heard. Let the praise be heard. Let the glory go up. Let the glory come down as the praise go up. God's glory is in this place. We give it thanks that the glory of the Lord is going to fill this place. Let me praise that the glory will come down. God's glory, God's glory, God's glory. Not my glory, not your glory, not your glory, not your glory, but God's glory.
and nail up all the windows. And there is nowhere out. God will take the roof off and pour him out a blessing. Send it on down, Lord. Send it on down. Lord, send the Holy Ghost on down. And when the rain starts to come and the roof looks like it's good, then the Lord make it start to leak because the blessing has to come through some way, somehow. The blessing of the Lord is going to come through. You don't have to worry how God is going to do it. Just trust the Lord and know that He will do it. It's not my concern how He's going to do it. I'm just going to trust Him because I know He is going to do it. Don't try to figure out God. You don't try to figure out God. God is the Lord. The other day we had some good weather and nobody knew it was going to snow. But then guess what? One day it snow. Send on down low. You may not expect the blessing, but Lord, nevertheless, just bless me, Lord. Just bless me, Lord. And you know what? Just hold your hand up and say, Lord,
may do me like nobody else. He gave me the Holy Ghost. I got the Ghost, I got the Ghost. The Holy Ghost. My wife can't do that. She can't do that. There's a feeling that the wife can give me that Jesus can't give me. Oh, hallelujah. Sometimes, sometimes when I have my legs go to me, sometimes I my hands go on my side. I don't know what happened. What's going on? It's the Holy Ghost. It's the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Sometimes, sometimes I go down to the kitchen at night. Oh, hallelujah. I get out of bed. And I go to the kitchen. And I sit around the table with my Bible out. And I begin to talk to Jesus. I say, I begin to talk to Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. In the middle of the night, me and Jesus got a conversation going on. Oh, hallelujah. It's something great. It's something great. My, 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 my. If you don't have the Holy Ghost that day, you should get it for you. You should get it, you should get it, you should get it. You should get it. Amen. It's a feeling. I don't know. I can't explain. I can't even explain it. Like this feeling that I have. I can't even explain it. But I know it's good. I know it's good anyway. Praise the Lord. Lord bless you. Amen. I heard the praises out here. I want to get me involved in it. Don't leave me out of the praise. Oh, I mean, don't give it to the young people. Hold my portion too. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. I want my portion too. I want to give it all to the young people. I'm sitting back and back there somewhere. No, no, no. Lord, bless me. Why are you blessing me? Don't you forget it, forget it, forget about me. Don't forget it, why you bless others. And point at your blessing, don't forget about me. Amen. Pray the Lord. Oh, gentle Savior. Hear my humble cry. Yes, yes. My other the call, do not pass me. Do not pass me back. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. Ah. Oh. May God bless you. May it keep you until we meet again. And I'm looking to meet with you in praise service, in morning service. One more time. One more time. I'd be glad to see you one more time. Again, 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 again. Until he comes. Amen. I love the saints of God. Amen. I love y'all. From the pulpit to the door. Amen. And I love the saints that I don't know. Amen. Praise the Lord. They can be in Paris. They can be in Germany. Amen. They can be in but I still love them. Amen. Praise the Lord. May God bless you. May he keep you. Until we meet again.